The rules for this Harbinger Moriko challenge should be on screen right now. Positive, you need to look at the rules, otherwise I'll just get right into it. Um, this one, amazingly enough, the rules... I'm just gonna write this down, so again, hitting quick play as usual, but... I did make the rules before I started this whole series, so each and every one of these uh, challenges and their rules were made before I started the series. Um, yeah, so some of them, some of these rules might uh, look like they've been uh, changed after the fact. I swear they haven't. And if you've been looking at the certain document I have available, that should be in the link to this link should to be in the yeah description below. Uh, but yeah, they've already been written beforehand, so it looks like I changed them, but I actually haven't changed them since I wrote them down. And the um, reason for that is because I want to try all these challenges without editing them first because I didn't get to test them out. And that's partly my fault, but... Yeah, I, I didn't have time. <laughs> so, Goizo World of Horror Character Specific Perks Timeline B, let's go. I uh, have to disable all locations except for home, school, tree, and uh, illegal den immediately. Um, and the reason why these are allowed is because, well, the ammo, the ammo, uh, rule set is, uh, can be pretty bad. So home, school, tree, and illegal den. And mainly, illegal den, it's mainly because there, I know you can purchase ammo from here. If not, then I'm making mistakes somehow, but, uh, mm. And I have to defeat two weapons with fire weapon twice, but as long as I have boss encounters, well, we'll see, actually. <laughs> I cannot equip old shotgun, cannot be unequipped. Light check, knowledge, dexterity, second mystery, strength. Hmm. Uh, considering, I think, I believe, if I recall correctly without even looking at my notes, Moriko has, starts out with the lowest um, total base stats. If you look at, if you add up all her stats, minus funds and luck, of course, um, she has the lowest total stat count from all the characters, and that's because she starts out with the gun, and her perks help her blow things apart, but on a Harbinger run, that may mean nothing because the lower stats you have, especially if it's strength, since I like to brace, or any other stat if you like to build towards any other weapon, or depending on what actions you like to do, then, uh, yeah, that's not as great for playing Moriko. Again, like I said, her gun is pretty helpful all on its own, uh, but with this challenge, we're gonna see. So, we grab this rumor, uh, put this on and let's go. No, no special background. I'm gonna take the funds out now because Doom is usually a factor uh, in a Harbinger run. Uh, we do have a boss, Hell, Bulletin. We have another boss if we wanted to, but uh, Ramen and Sailors. And we have another boss, but I don't want to fight this one. Probably want to fight this one instead. Um, if we're looking at a boss that I want to shoot for sure. Otherwise, I want to just I just want to shoot at an enemy and Hell, Bulletin, or Ramen. Um, but it'll depend. So, let me just make sure. Hmm. Do I want to take... I'm going to take Sailor as probably like 4th or 5th in hopes that I get to throw away 2 uh, items. Um, I can't buy any items because I disabled all, all their locations except for the specific 4. And uh, I can, my ammo can't reach a 0 at any time. So... D hmm. The question is, do I want to take... Mermaids right away. Will I level up is the question. The reason why I asked that is because I need to get ammo, uh, ammo stash, the perk for Moriko. Otherwise, I will run out of ammo unless I somehow gather up five funds to go for the, to legal den. Uh, which I can do with uh, three tree visits. That's partly why tree's there, to stop with the RNG of getting um, ammo stash. But let me see here. I think we're going to take bulletin and stall out. Mermaids for like one or two mysteries. We'll see where we're at. We definitely want to do this forest investigation. Um, I'd rather take the hasty aid. Granted, I do lose stamina, but if I if I got like badly bleeding or something instead, that could be even worse. So because the overall fun funds I would have to spend uh, or resources I lose overall would be worse for badly bleeding if I don't have the funds to spend immediately to get rid of a stamina bleed out perk we'll just call it i'll just call it so um the point of this challenge is to force me to shoot twice uh i would like to shoot rng if rng is good to me i will get an encounter near the end of the mystery and no other encounters um i needed some i wanted some rng but it rolled a 12 so nat 12 lucky 12 natural nat yeah uh, brain damage, that's not going to help my knowledge, especially, so I'm definitely taking three stamina in the lighthouse check. But like, was, as, I was, as I was saying, uh, the RNG, I would like to run to an enemy near the end of the mystery. Best RNG is at the end of the mystery, and then shoot that enemy that way. I'm not 
suffering, because the bad part is if you get ringing ears and then you run into another encounter, you're, I'm probably not getting away. Granted, I have uh, Goizo. Mm, do I want to spend the Doom here? 32% Doom, that's kind of high. Granted, I've run into a lot of events that's uh, that have auto-raised my Doom, but... Uh, this could be really, really good. This is a complete RNG fest. Considering I have Hell, Ramen, Hell, Ramen, Mermaid, so those are pretty standard for Doom. And I'm not under Yogothag and uh, Knight Errant, but I am... Again, this is RNG, but I am in Goizo, which means my healing sucks for resting at home. Um, and home is still allowed, so... Let's roll on RNG. This this is probably the, the turning point of this run. Okay, so we did get a very good one. We got two good ones, actually. Um, so I'm happy with that. A grant, granted, Hermit, you have to spend five reason to get rid of that. And if I run into a reason encounter right now, I'm probably dead. But Okay, so we're probably going to shoot this one. Um, which means I'm not taking Mermaids because I probably need a perk. And I'm not going to level up. <sighs> Unless I tree for funds. It's not so bad, because if I plan to shoot anyway, um... If I plan to shoot anyway, it's not like being too slow will hurt me. It will hurt me in any other encounter, and I don't have police station, so I can't reduce my encounter rate. If that helps me significantly at all, but... Uh... Granted, Ryoko is putting in her work, um... One damage to weapons is very substantial, so... Uh, unless I have to kick, but... Okay, so I do get out of this immediately. I will take plus two doom, question mark. Unless I RNG this, because uh, this is not... Well, 97%... If Okay, if I miss this, I'm going to yell pants stats at the top, top of my lungs. Okay, good. That way we're losing less doom, quote-unquote, and then we'll shoot him here. So we've shot one out of two, and I didn't do the two investigation. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, I'm just going to have to do this. <sighs> I totally forgot. Well, actually, this could be good or worse because I didn't, I didn't, I wouldn't know, uh, it's not like I knew beforehand that, uh, if I went into the forest and ran into a counter, that would have been worse. Um, maybe, but we'll, <laughs> The past is the past. 30% doom in my first mystery is not great, though. Um... <laughs> I'm I'm chiding myself right now. Uh, I do need to level up again, so I'm going to take another mystery before mermaids. Let's take ramen. Uh, I don't. I really don't want to rest. Uh, and the reason for that is because 5% doom. 5% uh, doom with 31%. Well, I could do this. I won't die, will I? No, I won't. So that's going to help me combat the Doom, but I think I need to heal Reason somewhere. Or I could run to Yasugi-san and uh, trade strength, but if I run... Okay, we'll, we'll gamble. Let's hope we run to Yasugi-san. Let's hope... I I really don't want to spend this Doom. Yes, it'll prevent me from dying, but this time I'm going to roll an RNG to and risk dying immediately. <sighs> Thankfully, I can run. This is what I was afraid of. I have to run. I don't have a choice. Um... Well, I do have a choice. I could have desperation into something. Uh, definitely pro would have could have uh, tried to dodge, but that's probably my real only option. I'm gonna keep rolling for Yasugi-san, though. Um, yes, I've already. Okay, good. I forgot. I almost forgot which one was stamina loss, but like I said, I'm taking a big risk by uh, just continuing to investigate. So we're gonna trade stamina for reason, and we should be somewhat okay now. Uh, you know what? Let's. 36% do. In case we don't get ammo stash, I think... You can think with me right now. Uh, that's part of the reason why I do these challenges, so that maybe you can come up with strats, but if I don't get the ammo stash right away, it's a waste of resources because I've wasted Doom. Otherwise, um, it's better if I get ammo stash right... Uh, or the buy ammo right away, um, because if I don't get ammo stash, then I waste Doom rerolling. So let's go for it. And... Yeah, that was pretty bad. <sighs> Let's... We're in here. We might as well re-roll. Okay. Now I'm just curious. Really? 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 Well, okay. Now... Okay. I, there, was, there is extra ammo here, but... Uh, you know what? Let's just struggle till the end. 
that was a really bad shop RNG, but I was just curious for the sake of being curious. Uh, I'm probably going to have to queue out in a moment. I'm going to just kind of just rush through this now because I that was really bad RNG. Uh, <laughs> considering I rerolled so many times, I might as well use it now. Um, and we just have to roll on RNG here. Yeah, that's not great. 63% Doom for third mystery is not great at all. I I'm going to queue out and I'm going to do a real another run real quick. Oh, so we did get ammo stash immediately. <laughs> So that was a bad choice. Uh, I'm just gonna start over again uh, and do another run because that one is. Pro I'm not gonna. Usually I would struggle till the end, but that that's not great. Um, so we're gonna hit quick play, do the, all this. It throw two world of four again. Um, all perks. I don't think I need to. Okay, so this is this is a run where because I didn't say that I had to be only Moriko perks. So having all perks means I have a very I have a lower chance. I was about to say very lower chance. Lower chance of getting ammo stash, um, which means I'm probably gonna need to buy ammo. Which if I don't get if I don't get uh, funds from somewhere, I need to tree three times, uh, which will be very very bad. So all perks and. Uh, Roll the four backstory just to make sure. It's already it's by that by default, but and it though too, so I'll be doing more damage. But I might have been okay if I didn't have to roll on allies for ten percent doom for allies. Yes, I did have hermit as well, but I... sixty. Well, technically, we're gonna hope uh, just so theoretically while I'm going through this. So theoretically, um, I had uh, fifty three percent doom if I had enough reason to spend. Um, somehow, we'll just assume that I did, but, uh, yeah, even if that was the case, 53% Doom on my third mystery, you know, some people might risk that, but on Harbinger, um, it's, it's less likely. So we're gonna do this again. Actually, I should just look at my mysteries, that way I'm not wasting too much time. But, uh, wow, really? So this, what a, what bad RNG. Did I really not run into the rumor yet? Maybe flashing lights warning, but I'm gonna do it three more times. Okay, so I finally got it. You know what? I'm gonna limit myself there. <clears throat> Just the general rule for myself, uh, informally. But uh, so I'm only gonna check the rumors like three, uh, three times. If I don't get it, then I don't get it. Bulletin scissors, botanist, vigil, cave. So I do have some forest investigations, but we'll see if I get outdoorsman. Uh, multiply wound is pretty situational, but. Um, I could shoot at the old man here, so maybe that's what I'll do. Depends. I don't have eels, so... Otherwise, I'll probably take scissors um, and uh, shoot the encounter here, because 66% chance. Or I could do Akamanto, because that's as well. I have Akamanto as well, so... <sighs> you know what? Let's check the lighthouse so that I don't... I am... Uh... I'm not thinking too hard um, about whether I'm not. I don't have to worry. So I do have the second encounter strength, dexterity, so that mm, and uh, charisma. So mm, big mm, light check as well. I'm probably gonna fail all of those checks. I'm just gonna. I just assume that right off the bat. But uh, there's no. Well, I could mm, bulletin. Bulletin with school I uh, scissors I considered cancel each other out in terms of doom. So the reason why I asked that is because I might want to ritual during the old man once. Only need to once for the strat I'm going to do. Or twice if I want to go spicy. Um, or yeah, the strat that I usually have done so far in my videos. Akamanto I want to take before the fourth mystery. He's going to have more HP but I need to prep. Um, so vigil scissors, which means I have no chance to rest. Vigil Scissors Cape, Botanist Bulletin, yeah. I think that's going to be what I have to do, though. Um, I can't equip the... Uh... Yeah, I can't equip the uh, Meat Cleaver, so... Search the room, well, well, that's that, but... Let's just see what happens. Let's just see what happens this run. Uh, I'll probably, you know, just to balance it out, I'll play it safer this run, so if I have to rely on RNG... Uh, bad RNG, let's say close to a 50-50, then, uh... It has to be real close. If I'm, like, 80-90, then... Essentially, if I bow, clap, bow, bow, clap, bow... Hope I got that right. Let me concentrate. Okay, good. Um, and, and watch it, I get that wrong. But, uh, what I mean by that is if I have, like, a 90-80-80% chance to hit, 
um, three hits in a row and I want to gamble on that, then I'll probably take that gamble. But if it's something that I'm not as sure about, so basically my own mind RNG, then uh, I'm not going to do it. So I should store the energy drink in case I run... Okay, so it won't. doesn't matter. I could shoot this encounter. Um... It's not gonna matter too much. Is Rio did Rio go? Okay, no, this is a though too. That's why I was a little confused. Fifty percent chance. So the, like in RNG, seventy percent is not close to fifty. Some people would gamble on this. I'm not gonna gamble on that. So uh, instead, I'm gonna do a close a closer gamble. This is like, but this is for a one shot. Uh, no, I thought I would get at least eighty percent. Do I want to throw the meat cleaver right away and then just do a strong attack? Probably. Yeah, because that's a lot of reason to lose, even if I brace. Uh, can I do you get a guaranteed kick? I think I can, right? Yeah, so, again, Etho 2 now works both ways. Uh, the change was a change. If you didn't know, Etho 2 used to only buff um, energy, uh, enemy, uh, energy, enemy damage. Now, player damage is also buffed, so... It is what it is. I'm not going to complain about it. So, uh, I'll, although it would be interesting to get it out to get a, uh, a little setting that switches it back, which would be interesting, but I'm not going to pressure pants as to do anything like that. Again, as I said, I'll store the energy drink so I can get a sewing kit, assuming I passed that, which I did. So, thank goodness for that. Grant, I'm not going to need the charisma. I don't think I'm going to get to eight, to eight, eight charisma. So, that's why that. Um, so one reason, and theoretically, uh, spending Doom to do these, uh, <sighs> this is a really bad encounter to run into in Harbinger, I just realized. Um, and especially since I can't brace, if I had 8 strength, I'd be able to at least brace into Sever, that way I only lose minus 2 all, but with this, that's, overall it's not efficient. So I'm going to play it safe and run. Granted, I'm about to run into this old man who's probably going to be doing 3 damage per, which means I'll take 6 damage for, uh... Um... And also because I want to shoot him, so this is efficient for the challenge-wise. I think it's efficient if we're looking at trying to do the challenge at the same time. But let's do 5 claps and see where we're at. So, uh... 4 ritual moves. Okay, do I want to... You know what, let's do it. So... This is a spicy strat. You don't need to do this. You only need to do five claps before you go into scissors, but I'm just going to do this just to see. So I know that the last one is also a clap, so uh, yeah. I'm going to keep that information in the back of my mind as I... Uh, hmm. I'm thinking of whether or not I want to... Uh, because I could do this, you know, it would be more uh, efficient. Unless I can do somehow, like, well, no, because it's not, it is not, 95%, let's see, 95%, 3% doom, 50 damage, 3% doom, close to 50 damage, unless I miss, obviously, um, and I don't, it's not like I need the ending, this is only going to really affect my ending, unless I somehow lose reason, I forgot, it's been a long time since I did this action, Unless I do this into this, then it's more 85% chance to hit. Oh goodness, this this has gone badly for me before. Because I do this... It's more efficient if I do this and they hit. So let, you know what, let's roll on this RNG here at least once. Um, Do it again. Oh! I messed up. Oh, goodness. I was supposed to shoot him. <laughs> That's not great. I messed that up. Really? That counts as an instant kill? Uh, unless that also... Okay, so... That was my mistake. Uh, that was not good. Take the free experience because we're, we're already topped off on healing. And if we see a bow here, then we know what the ritual is. Otherwise, we're in a pretty precarious situation. So it's clap, bow... Clap, clap, bow. I know the I know what the ritual is. Um, yeah, that was really bad. Uh, 
So we definitely want to shoot this last encounter. Oh, okay, so we could just end up sh No, we can't because I need to not run into zero, uh... That's the wrong item. We need to not hit zero ammo, otherwise we fail the challenge. Um... That's fine. I'll just shoot Akamanto as well. Um, and hopefully we get ammo stash out of all perks, because that's... Otherwise we're gonna have to treat three times for Akamanto, which means um, I'm getting three curses, but... I wonder if I could shoot this one. Would it be worth it? If I don't run into uh, the middle encounter... Let's just do it. Uh, either way, I need the uh, experience, so... Uh, Again, the reason why I'm taking this is to level up faster. I was thinking about, for some reason, I for, for a moment I thought it was Yashiro and I could shoot her, but uh, I could also throw this and get rid of her quicker because you can still do that, but I'm gonna, I am need I need as much experience as I can get because including the corpse dust, that'll be uh, enough experience to level up. And I don't think I'll need the luck too much, so we'll see. Um, that really hurts my luck based checks. Okay, so I didn't run into an encounter, which is gonna be, which is gonna really suck. Uh, Ammo stash, please. Okay, good. Thank goodness for that. Um, I do. Have, do I have the strength check? If I have the strength check, I should be doing that. Ritual doesn't. Uh, the sigil doesn't matter. Okay, so we did run into the. Okay, so thankfully we ran to the one encounter that we can one shot with the power of a shotgun. This act. So overall, that encounter is good for Moriko no matter what. But unless for some reason you can't fit a prep shot in, but. I'm gonna take a detour. Yes, I'm hurting on Doom, but I'm in scissors right now. We do have Bulletin, but we should be okay. Um, it was really... We did get good RNG. I'm not gonna say we didn't. Unless I somehow mess all of these up, but it should be this ritual, right? What? Really? No? What? What? Wait. What's that? Oh, I, I must have miss, uh, misread this ritual. It was bow, clap, 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 clap. Uh, okay. That was interesting. Okay, so again, if if the challenges aren't actually hard, just say it right now, it's me that's making it harder for myself. Actually, let me check. Animated head, uh, and then uh, old horrible old man, I think. I, didn't, I haven't gotten to shoot any of my bullets, by the way, so uh, I am a little bit worried. But we'll find out when we get there. I technically I should sell those library notes. I'm not gonna get any other. Well, I could. I might be able to roll on it, but uh, we're definitely taking Akamanto now. And uh, we'll see. We definitely want to gossip. That's the reason why I leave school for Harbinger. If you want to make the challenge harder, you can always just disable school. But I highly. I think that's more relying on too relying too much on RNG. Um. Overall, so I, that's the best way I can say it without going too much into the details of uh, how challenges are balanced. There's no point. Of course, I, no, there's no point. So we're just gonna keep going. Uh, I'm not gonna shoot any of my bullets until uh, school and uh, until Akamanto, and I, I'm gonna, I need the funds more than the reason. I'm, I, I'm, I'm thinking right now. Well, that's 2% doom, <laughs> I was about to say. For, for, for dexterity, there's no way I was going to pass that. I mean, th I had a chance of passing it, but... That, however, yeah, I definitely didn't want to... Uh... <sighs> well, that's unfortunate. Let's see here. Am I on Goizen or on a Thotu? Do I have Feeded Fumes? No, I don't. So I definitely want to rest before Akamanto, but I'm going to see where my damage is at, or how much how damaged I am before we get there for funds, um, and then we'll rest about three, well, two times. We'll rest twice. I don't think I'll need more than, uh, well, this is kind of gambling, but I don't want to spend too much Doom as well. Um, I might want to shoot Akamato a whole bunch, is my... So we're definitely still shooting Akamanto. In the back of my mind, I knew there were cigarettes, but if I didn't, so if I didn't get the uh, ammo, I was like, cigarettes maybe question mark. Uh, so we're gonna do this. If we run into an encounter again, I'm gonna be very surprised. Didn't I shoot the? Okay, so I did. No, I shot the young witch, right? Okay, so I did shoot the young witch. I was almost. Oh, that's not great. I wanted to be at least 10-10, but. Uh, 
Okay, so I did do the challenge, right? Question mark? Um... So all we need to do is shoot one encounter. Still, the ammo stash is going to help if I want to shoot anything else. Um, but this is going to be very painful. Granted, I have the cigarette still, but... What's my chance to hit? 90% chance. It will help me. I think it this breaks the threshold, because uh, to all... 7, 7, 14, 6 all, and then I shoot him to kill him. Uh, I could throw these as well, so let's do that. We have also have the sewing kit hair, so like I said, RNG was nice to us, but some str strategy was required. And granted, if I did the scissors ritual right, I would be better off than I am now, but... Yeah, so I should be only be losing minus 4 all, and that I, I consider that very good for a boss encounter on Harbinger. So, uh, yeah. Granted, I'm going to run into Nicotine Withdrawal at the end of the run, but... <sighs> Did I lose something? What? Why can't I do that anymore? Well, it doesn't matter. I should be able to still shoot him for only minus four all uh, total. So, yeah, here we go. We get, we get another bullet to shoot at any other encounter. So even if we didn't pass it, well, that's bad luck. So RNGs, why did I do that? Um... Okay, so we don't have any allies. We still have, uh... This is good, too. Oh, my goodness. No bath. Healing or stats for encounters. Eight strength. Eight strength. Huh, it's a toss-up here. This is really, really good on Harbinger. Um... Especially on Moriko, who doesn't start with great base stats. This pretty much put her, puts her back. Um, in terms of her starting base stats in total. Oh, or the stamina heal because I lost Bath. Do I have Feeded Fumes? Did I check? I forgot to check, didn't I? No, I didn't. Okay, so, I mean, that's right. I had the Bath. What am I thinking? So I still can rest for 3% Doom. 53% Doom. Some people would choose Daddy's Girl. I'm gonna choose On Your Own. Technically, I don't need to double stack Strength because I already have 8 Strength, but if I need to Brace during encounters, especially after Nicotine Withdrawal, um... Otherwise, I would go Knowledge. I think I have the Knowledge check. I do have the Knowledge check, right? I'm gonna check right now just to make sure. Otherwise, I've just hurt myself. No, I don't. I don't have the knowledge check. That was last run. Gosh dang it. Uh, I mean, I could have gone for... Yeah, I should have gone for the Charisma then. Now I need to level up twice to get Charisma to 8, but... If I get hungry, it doesn't matter anyway. Um, I have the Sewing Kit hair, but I'm not going to rely on that totally. Which, I mean, I should use it now. It's not going to matter. But, um... <sighs> Let's go Botanist and see where we're at. I'm just going to rush through. Uh, I'm not going to rely on the fact that I have... That, thanks for that spell. Um, granted, if I still had the library notes, I probably might have been able to make use of that, but... Uh, lose reason. Yes, I could have gotten experience there. Okay, so let's rest once. That should be safe enough. 63% uh, doom on my fourth mystery. I'm saying that more for myself, but you can think too. Uh, that's free, and let's get stuck in this forest. Uh, I'm going to run to nicotine withdrawal. Bad RNG means that... Nice... Stats don't matter. Um, eh, let's see here. Yeah, if I run into nicotine... <sighs> Both my dexterity and my charisma are bad, but... Okay. That helps with the light check. Um, and if I run into an encounter, I'll probably just shoot at it. Um, because I have the luxury to. I'm going to lose reason here. Or not. But... <sighs> Thankfully, stats worked out, but... You know. Reason loss, I'll take that. Because we're low on stamina. If I if I took Daddy's girl, I might have risked the dog. But oh, also I have all. But I have all of my own, so I don't want the dog anyway. Uh, this, on the other hand, uh, this should be a free out because I shoot for. Okay, I, I shoot for that. So minus two all. I also get. Uh, is it this one? No, I don't. Uh, why did I think I get a branch from that one? It's another encounter I'm mistaking it for. 70% Doom. My Doom is rising pretty high. Uh, so I need to definitely just rush through. 
I don't think I'll be able to... Uh, well, I might be able to level up again. Not that it matters too much. Yeah, six all. Get out of here. <laughs> um, to anyone who has the... Uh, who has the brashness to fight this encounter with no with no uh, Kana at 4th Mystery onward, I salute you. I choose not to. Um, and... Uh, say... Well, well... I didn't know I was going to get... Well, no, I needed the cigarettes because I wasn't going to get it beforehand. Ugh. Let me think here. Reason or Charisma? If I level up again, I should take Charisma. But the Charisma check is the second one, so I won't level up beforehand. If Charisma was the last one, I'd probably be able to level up. Um, but since it's not, I'm not going to rely, rely on that RNG. On the RNG of getting experience in the middle of the mystery. Granted, I have nine investigations, but... And I probably only can risk one more rest. I don't have bath anymore. And I need to... This is going to be a long one because I'm going to investigate force as well. And I'm about to run out of... Uh... You know what? <sighs> I'm going to do that to stave off the pickpocket. But I'm going to heal uh, stamina. Because I don't want to spend any more doom. Uh... And I'm on now. I'm on nicotine withdrawal, so I'm pretty close to uh, cause uh, nicotine withdrawal and uh, fast swimmer are gonna counteract each other somewhat. Um, but I think I'm over. I think if I recall correctly, I'm losing more. Uh, I will remember to investigate forest again. That's not great. Uh, so I definitely don't want to rest again. But they, I'm gonna be a little bit over the normal multiplier. Don't need this forest note, I'll just throw it away, or put it in the storage. Um, invisibility, but... <sighs> Spend for reason. I don't have, even if I had the light check, I wouldn't lose any more reason. The problem is... <sighs> but I run from any encounter... And I don't think I'll run into the Glitch Magician because I'm on a throw too. I think that's how that one works, if I recall correctly. <sighs> Let's do it. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to forget them both because I won't need them anymore. Um, and we'll see if we lose reason through events. I need to play it safe, though. That's basically just an offset. Unless I lost more reason there, but... Uh, we're gonna see. We're gonna see what happens. Uh, definitely trading stamina. We don't have enough doom to spare anymore. Uh, we lose the dexterity check. We lose the lighthouse check. I'm gonna trade that for doom because I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna roll on the fact that... Uh, heal reason. Ooh, this could be really... Yes, I my doom is comfortable. I'm worried about my reason, and we're definitely running from this one. Um, that means I oh, let's keep going because you get experience for investigating. Why would I risk this? I think I got holes, so it doesn't matter. Those don't stack. So I have seven stamina at the end here. Old man, right? Horrible old man was my second encounter. <sighs> nice doom rise. Um, uh, I, why does a cut arm sinew affect how much damage I do for shooting? I will never know, but... I'm going to hold my breath. Some some of you out there who are more knowledgeable in this game may know that I may survive this guaranteed. But I could always die due to human error. Or what I'm saying is if you're a veteran at this game, you probably survived this run already. Uh, my issue is what happens when you don't. Um. Well, we're in it now. Um. Like I said, I shouldn't be losing more than three reason. So, I should be okay, question mark. Question mark? 
Charisma, Strength, I passed that. I have the Flashlight. Second Encounter, I should remember it theoretically. Dexterity. No, I should be fine, right? No talk, no other sources of Doom loss, so I should be able to just climb this and be okay? Question mark? Unless I accidentally hit the wrong uh, option when I get to the light check. But that should never happen. Uh, horrible old man, never mind. I, Oh yeah, discipline. I succeeded that quote-unquote check. But I should be fine unless I have a branded proc. But uh, yeah. Yeah, okay, I'm good. Huh, unless I accidentally messed up one of my rules, but that should be that. And if I did, I'm going to yell at myself in my edit below and call this a fake one. But that, but that should be okay. Uh, if not, I have done the challenge, so I've done two two in a row, except for everything else, um, if you've watched all of my videos. If you watched this whole video up to this point, I'd like to thank you for watching. You know the duel. You'll probably already exit the video by now, so Jared and MML, I'll be back.